Hi, hey, buddy. Welcome back. So, I'm here by Tom Hall. I should mind. I didn't. I suppose. Because now that we've actually defeated uh, Taurus, we can actually get his armor. I was grinding for a bit to actually get it. Thank you. That was a fine trade. I have. Yeah, sure, whatever. Um. So you notice I'm wearing Chester's long coat, and it's mostly because of the blood resistance on it. It, it gives me a little bit more. Uh, so you know, it's relatively useful. Their armor. Oh, right, yeah. I just haven't put it away yet. Yeah, I'm heavy. So, we still have a few more things in Ula Seal for us to do. I still need to look for the uh, key. Mm. Hmm. I was really tired. Um, work was not fun today. <laughs> Let's just say that. said I have actually gotten a little bit better at pairing these guys. Oh wait, I forgot something. Um, I didn't want to accidentally use it. So I put Artorias' soul in the box. So I have to go get that. So, um... Well, it's kind of interesting. I, I was building up a Taurus to be like the hardest boss in the series. There is technically one other guy that kind of rivals him in a later game, but... I'm still serious when I say that, like... It's probably going to be the guy that I have the most challenge with because of my want to not go into the DLCs until New Game Plus, which is definitely going to come back to bite me in the uh, third game probably. Hug the wall. So, I... My setup is a little bit different now. Uh, not only do I have a second screen, but... Kind of like constantly like leaned over into the microphone. <laughs> uh, I need to get a better way of setting this up. But for now it's okay. And it's already like set up for for like multiple people.
You. Is that not the soul of the man who fell on this spot? He was a dear friend. I wish to pay proper respect with that soul. Would you be willing to part with it? Uh, sadly I can't. Yes, of course. Artorius would not have approved. Yeah. So this is a uh, Kieran or Karan. I forget how you actually pronounce her name. What is it? Something else? Have you changed your? Then you have no business. Uh, I would normally help her out with this. Uh, so she is the bearer of the Hornet Ring, and if you remember. Uh, behind the stone was the hornet ring. So it's basically due to the fact that she tends to the grave as long as she can and then just dies behind the grave as it. As this whole arena, which is Sif's boss arena as well, uh, eventually gets to the point where she can't maintain it anymore and she just dies. Sadly, though, I need her armor, which means I need to actually take her out. <laughs> you humans, always taking what you please, then I shall do the same. Sorry, uh, sorry, Kieran. Still got that. I was surprised. But how? Yeah, you sorry, I got humans, my dear. Okay, gold and silver tracer, her armor set. Her armor set's pretty cool. Uh, so her daggers are actually pretty interesting because uh, you know, one is supposed to be used regularly, one is supposed to be used in the offhand, like she was using. And eventually, um, and if you actually wear the Hornet Ring, you get a third attack. And you basically just blow the guy onto the ground. It's kind of a cool thing. Don't think I have the stats for it. Let's go back to uh, our set. Okay. So, I have no idea what this is. Purple Coward's Crystal. Uh, oh, okay. So, this is the, uh, it's the Duel Arena. Okay. I just never really knew. Is 
So I'm going to probably run a few experiments when it comes to Hello guys, can you drop your head? Hmm. actually gonna boost item discovery a little bit so these bloated uh, citizens villagers whatever they can drop their head as a uh, as an item there we go bloated head doesn't do much for you. I mean, not really. This is just an interesting item. This is the shortcut back. There they are. So, that is a sorcerer. The sorcerer can also drop a head. And as you can see, the head is slightly different. Spawns. A lot of twists and turns in this place. down yeah I have no idea so I believe Good way to There's no good way to explore this area. close uh, I am very worried I like every step I take Well, that's 
that's rude. Stop. Mm. That was rude. Well, this is a good time anyway. Okay. Warp to Willisil Sanctuary. Ship. There we go. We got a more significant warp point. Where then tell a till they reach a sorcerer. Checking. I'm supposed to be able to find a key somewhere. I cannot remember where. Sorcerer is just around the corner. I also confirmed that they respawn. Probably gonna take a little bit of grinding. <sighs> okay, that took a bit. The uh, bloated sorcerer variant. Oh, that's what a uh, very one looks like. The uh, s sorcerer head. A little bit different. Technically, it's pretty cool. You know, it's like, it's got the tentacle face. Mm. 
Yeah, I switched back to uh, my usual outfit because even though I really like Chester's coat, it gives me like no defense. Also, I ended up dying uh, to a random stray attack. So, I lost all those souls down there, but yeah, oh, that's fine. So, I was yawning. Uh, even though it seems like a weird place to stop and it doesn't feel like this episode's gone on too long, I have to go to bed. <laughs> it's pretty late for me, so I'll probably do a little bit more recording in the, in the morning or something. I don't know. Uh, either way, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.